Hello everyone, today let's take a look at a software called 3D Home Architect which I downloaded from the Wayback Machine. So it is simply a home architecture software or uh, it is a software to design homes and it's designed to run uh, on Windows 3.1 or Windows 95 but we are trying to run it on Windows 10. Let's see what happens. It came in it came in one archive zip file and inside that zip file uh, there were uh, three more zip files which extracted to folders and uh, from those folders I copied all the contents to this folder right here only I had to skip the disk.id file because it is present in every three folders so windows didn't let me do it they didn't let me copy so let's very quickly run the setup i have otvdm installed and it is a 16 bit i have confirmed already so it will i think run through otvdm yes please wait copying the installer to temporary directory for edition 2 welcome to the installer for 3d home architect 2 if any time you wish to cancel the installation, press the escape key. Okay. Please choose your installation directory on a fixed drive. It says 3, C slash 3D home architect. C slash program files. Let's modify it. it automatically puts a space here so i can't modify this okay let it be like this and it's done it didn't take long install icons to broader band home products install icons to a different group so, okay let's keep this group installing icons and here what's the readme file wri file windows cannot open it okay installation successful be sure to read the readme file before running 3d home architect edition to remember to send in your registration card so the readme file is in .wri format which is not recognized by windows 10 okay it is otvdm let's close out of it 3d home architect 2 will it run reopen version 2161 mm why it is not displaying the GUI ok after pressing enter key 3d home architect copyright information please enter your full name ok so here it is I can draw anything because it's a uh, cannot create or modify a door or window because you click the left button too far from any wall it's it's used to design homes and I don't know why they included the word 3d because uh, everything looks 2d what's this it is an is, is this a window i think so and this i think is a desk and what's this item group and is this a chair and stairs what's this roof selection it's 
some rulers i think here is the plan camera let's set the viewpoint like this okay so it uh, gives our design 2d design a 3d look i didn't expect this i didn't even expect this to run under windows 10 so now let's design a good house so i have designed a very good house like this and let's see how it looks like with the camera with this viewing angle not bad just it does not look like a house but it looks like something with boxes and it and from another camera angle let's view some interior okay so toilet i have placed the toilet in the right orientation that's good i think here is the bathroom door can i zoom out no and from the front how does it look it looks a bit too congested and a far away view at least it looks like a house door but the door is a little up from the ground farther away view i think this would be good enough to view the whole house and nothing okay so it looks like this from the front so that was the house i designed and it looks like the software is not usable for designing homes anymore there are far newer and better ones to design homes so this was today's video and see you in my next video and if you want to see more such old software reviews, don't forget to subscribe.